Hi, I'm Mr. Reed from Wolverhampton Music Service. This video is to support beginner treble clef brass players who are playing the Just Play Treble Clef Brass book. In this video, we're going to look at Workout 33. This tune comes in three different versions, Level 1, Level 2 and Level 3. First, let's have a look at the new things that are written on this page. We start with, at the top of the page here, can you see the new note. This is ringing round the second line up on the stave, which means if you work it out, if E was the bottom line, it is two notes higher than E. So it is the note G, the highest one of your notes in this book. Also, we have a new length of note. Here it is written at the top of the page. This note is called a dotted minim and it lasts for three beats. Now, why? The answer is, a normal minim, the open circle with the stick, would last for two beats. The dot changes that two-beat note into a three-beat note, but it is not simply adding one beat to the note. It is making that note an extra half of the note long. So it is two beats plus half of the two beats that becomes three beats long. If you had a plain simple circle, the semi-brief, which would be four beats long, then an extra half of the four would be another two beats to add to it to make a total of six beats. You'll need a big bar to stick that one in. If, though, you had a crotchet, a one-beat note, then putting a dot on that note will be one plus an extra half of the one, which is another half a beat. So one and a half beats, when added together, add up to make one and a half. OK, so now looking at level one, the usual methods, let's have a look first of all at how long the notes are. So, 4-4 four, four time, 4 beats in each bar, back to the normal counting we've been doing. So here we go. After 4, 1, 2, 3, 4. 1, 1, 1, 1, 1, 1, 1, rest. 1, 1, 1, 1, 3, rest. 1, 1, 1, 1, 1, 1, 1, rest. 1, 1, 1, one, three, rest. And then, as usual, let's check the different notes out. So, after four, a one, two, three, four. C, 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 D, 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 rest. D, 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 E, rest. E, 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 F, 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 rest. D, 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 C, rest. One good tip with this tune that does actually apply to level 2 and level 3, if you notice, the first line finishes with the note E, the second line starts with the note E. That just happens to happen each time and makes it a lot easier to play, if you remember it. As usual, before you play the tune, I recommend you make sure you have warmed up properly because in this tune you're going to need all five different notes, either C, D, E, F and G or G, F, E, D and C, depending on your point of view. So please make sure you have got them working. Then, if you're ready to have a go at this tune, I will set the backing track going. So, work out 33, level 1. Here we go. 2, 3, 4, 2, 2, 3, 4, 3, 2, 3, 4, 4, 2, 3, 3. Good. Now we move on to level two. If you notice here, the counting is exactly the same. The difference is in the pattern of the notes. It's slightly more complicated. So let's check the pattern of the notes out. Are you ready? After four, a one, two, three, four. C, C, E, E, D, 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 then. D, D, F, F, E, then. E, E, G, G, F, 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 then. G, G, D, D, C. It's definitely a bit harder. You've got to get up to those Gs and down to those Cs. So you might need to play this through a couple of times before you have a go with the backing track. Get up to those notes, get down to those notes, depending on your point of view. Now, if you're ready, let's have a go and play Workout 33, Level 2. Here we go. 
two, three, four, two, two, three, four, three, two, three, four, four, two, three, three. Well done. Now let's move on to level three. Same counting, same set of notes involved, C, D, E, F and G, but a more complicated pattern. Having said that though, can you see that bar two and bar six, and in fact the bars at the end of each line, are the same each time? The changes are happening in these bars. One, three, five and seven. So it's not as different as it might be but that doesn't mean it is easy. It is the hardest one. So let's have a go and check the notes out on level three. Here we go. A one, two, three, four. C, E, C, E, D, 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 then. D, F, D, F, E, then. E, G, E, G, F, 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 then. G, F, E, D, C. All right, so as usual, check out your patterns, check the notes out, get them working before you have your proper go. Okay, if you're ready, let's have a go at level three. So work out 33, level three, the hardest version. Best of luck, here we go. Two, three, four, two, two, three, four, three, two, three, four, four, two, three, three. Well done. Now, as usual, to finish off this video, I'm going to play through the three different levels. Plus, you'll notice there's one extra at the end. So, here we go. Work out 33, level 1. 2, 3, 4, 2, 2, 3, 4, 3, 2, 3, 4, 4, 2, 3, 3. <laughs> And then level two. Two, three, four, two, two, three, four, three, two, three, four, four, two, three, three. Then level three. Two, three, four, two, two, three, four, three, two, three, four, four, two, three, three. <laughs> And now, with the miracles of modern technology, me playing all three parts at the same time. Here we go, work out 33. Two, three, four, two, two, three, four, three, two, three, four, four, two, three, three. <laughs> Thank you. 
Thank you for watching. Come back again to see the videos we will be releasing to support you at home. If you have enjoyed this video, subscribe to the channel and click the bell icon to receive notifications. Thank you.